Hey, good morning, Funko fam. On today's video, we have some awesome mail calls. We have one from Amazon. We have one from the Funko Pop Chick. We also have a viewer mail and an in-store pickup. Find out what I got after the intro. All right, so on today's video, like I said before, we have some pretty awesome mail calls. So instead of just repeating myself, let's go ahead and dig right in and see what I got. So we're gonna go ahead and start off. It'll be kind of a trend, kind of not. Eh, we'll just go ahead and dig in and see what we got. So we'll start off with the in-store pickup. So uh, unfortunately, I missed the, um, God, ugh, brain fart. So I missed the uh, pre-order for the GameStop exclusive uh, Mandalorian, you know, him jumping without the child with his pistol. Uh, kind of like that 330 NYCC exclusive from 2019. But, uh, so yeah, I missed that because, you know, GameStop's website, it, it, it hates me. It hates me with a passion. But, uh, so yeah, I missed it. Went into my local GameStop because they are, they actually treat me pretty good. There we go. Um... So I went in, was able to pre-order it because, like I said, they treat me pretty good. The guy, like I said, he treats me good. But I had a discount, and I found that pop that's sitting on top just chilling on the shelf. They, I guess, got their shipment in pretty late. So they actually had some just, uh, you know, shared ones, obviously, just chilling. So... Obviously, as you guys know, I still need to do my my video. I gotta reshoot it. But I get a new cam. As you can see, I'm back to the grainy cam because my brand new cam took a poop. Uh, so I'm going with the tried and true. Uh, I'm going back with Logitech because that's what's always worked well. Uh, the new cam should arrive this week. I'm gonna do the new reshoot with uh, the convention stuff that I got. I'm going to do it again this week, so you guys will get a second video this week, so stay tuned. Sorry for the crumminess. Sorry for not posting more stuff this week. Uh, I know. Uh, I'm a crummy YouTuber. Forgive me. But anyways, uh, so I was able to pick up the shared werewolf Bart. Uh, I will also show the normal one as well. And by normal, I mean the the con sticker one as well if I can actually talk today it's been a long day it's Monday um, so next we're gonna go ahead and dig in to Amazon so I'm not sure if any of you guys I hope I hope all of you guys do follow Funko Finders. Um, if not, definitely, definitely, definitely make sure you do. Whoa. Because if not, you guys miss out on deals, you miss out on so much information and opportunities uh, for things that you might need in your collection. So like right now, I'm Hawkeyeing the BlizzCon stuff that hopefully will be coming out any time now. So if anybody sees it, please let me know because I'm watching and hoping. But I saw this and uh, I jumped on it because obviously I'm a huge Overwatch fan and these are normally like 25 bucks. Now, granted, they only sell, re, you know, resell for like 10. And so when I saw it for 1050, uh, son of a gun. Well, hey, these typically don't always end up being that great a condition anyways, but I might be able to actually fix the box. So nevertheless, it was 1050. I got it for like half off, but yeah. A little, a little ding with the box right there and a little ding 
on the side, but hey, I probably can actually fix that. So we'll set it off to the side. Next. I think I either got sent an empty box of printer paper. <laughs> no. Um, so I think I, I think I know what's in here, but uh, then then is the king of wrapping things to the extreme, and I greatly appreciate it because I know whenever Vin sends me something, it's never ever ever gonna get damaged because dude is a legend. He takes uh, he takes wrapping to a new extent, and I think. He also gets a fat discount on shipping because there's no way in hell I could afford to ship things like this unless I got a fat discount on shipping, which, you know, I don't, but if I did, I would do this. <laughs> Alright, brother. Let's see. Yeah, dude. We got a lot of bubble wrap. Love it. Okay. See, folks, now that's how you package something not to get damaged. You can all take a lesson from Vin. Or if you read my Mercari reviews. Except for the one guy that gave me a four or a three. He said my pop was dirty. Guy was just salty because he had to spend fair market value on something. Oh, dude. Wow. Vinny. You are too kind, my friend. So. As I've stated before, my Walmart is booty. And he was able to pick me up. The beast flocked. So thank you, my friend. I appreciate this. And so this was also like a random thing. Um, I guess there might there's more that is coming my way. And I have absolutely no idea what's coming. So y'all stay tuned. Because suppose... So there's something else coming. I don't know what. All right. So now, I said there was a theme. So Funko Pop Chick, like I said, a theme. So Funko Pop Chick was doing a $30 mystery box. Um, and it was NYCC. Um, there was like 17 of 25 were... Con, uh, con stuff. Uh, I think there might have been a couple to shared. I will definitely insert uh, the picture. Um, the remainder were going to be decent hits. I think there was a couple things that were not shown. Everything else was pretty good. Ten bucks shipped, forty buck total. There was a Freddy soda. There was some really good looking stuff. Obviously, I want another Freddy soda. So. Here we go. Oh, now, as I open this, um, never got anything from her. Uh, so we're giving her a shot. I haven't bought a mystery box in a minute because there really hasn't been anything. And then since obviously I got the lottery, I really wasn't planning on buying a mystery box with NYCC stuff. But, you know, why not? I... I don't plan on opening the soda. I plan on keeping it closed. There's a method to the madness. I'll explain it later. If you want to ask me what my method to my madness is, hit me up on IG and I will explain myself. But if I get another Freddy, it's staying closed. Okay. It's definitely pop. So didn't get the Freddy.
stacks really well. I don't, I can't tell if it's uh, the con pop or not. But I don't think so. Nope. I flippin' hate anime. God, I hate this stuff. Of course, 25 box run, I get anime. But hey, watch, watch, it's not even worth, watch, it's not even worth what I paid. Let's see. Nope. So, Madeira reanimation. Negative Ghost Rider. Uh, it's worth uh, twenty dollars. So, yeah, not her fault, but yeah. So, I had over 75% chance of getting a NYCC hit, and I pull a stupid anime pop that I literally want to throw at the wall. So, hit me up if you need it, because I don't collect them, and that's uh, garbage to me. So, this is Mr. Piston, as always. Fire. Definitely fire. Discount came in a little damaged in fire. At least I got a pop protector and will sell. Because, uh, nope. And as always, like I said, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell notification, be notified every single time I drop a new video. And uh, hopefully I'll actually have a new camera that will record a video um, that's in better quality than 720 and is not like uh, grainy. And you'll be able to see what I'm actually showing you. Um, again, please like, share, subscribe, and uh, yeah, be nice to each other. There's enough hate in the world. We'll catch you on the next one. Thanks a lot. Thank you.